Over easy is the amount of fried. Think of over easy like your rare eggs, right? Over easy are your rare eggs. Over medium are your medium rare. And over hard is you're an idiot. You're an idiot. Because at that point, you might as well just do hard boiled and keep it clean and easy. Because hard boiled, you can make it a big old batch. Nothing wrong with hard boiled, they're delicious. But hard boiled is way better than over hard. Because over hard now, you're just like, you're overcooking the edges and getting a hard yolk. It's just weird. So, hard boiled for the ease, just drop fucking 20 of them in a vat and boil them, and you're good for a week. Or, like, I do like doing that because they're easy for, uh, they're easy for lunch snack too. Hard boiled, salt, smash, gone. Um, like, hard boiled for ease of, like, preparation, beautiful lunch snack, peel it in two seconds, salt, boom, gone, literally one tap, smoke it right through the mouth, like a b <coughs> nut sack. <clears throat> uh, over easy is disgusting, just, it's just, it's like, it's like you started cooking it and stopped, and you just quit halfway through. Over medium is ideal and perfect, but the window for over medium is, like, nine seconds before it goes to over hard or it's still over easy uh but over medium is perfectly done i don't know over medium has taken me forever to get good at flipping eggs but it's when you i started a medium high right start a medium high throw a little bit of butter on there let the butter melt move it around the pan move the butter around the pan crack it down to low now now that it's now that it's hot and the butter's melted, put it on low. Because why am I going to wait for the butter to melt on low? That's going to take too long. Thank you for the five bits, Lord Xanthos. So, uh, so the thing's on low now, not medium high anymore. Crack the egg, crack the egg, crack the egg, put them on. And then salt them and pepper them, put the lid on. Leave the lid on until around, uh, around the yolk is starting to get, like, close to white. Like, sort of close to white, not quite. Like, it's like a, get the yellowish hue is going away and it's getting close to white. That, and you have to leave the cover on the whole time for this to work. And then, at that exact moment, you flip it very carefully, because the yolk will still break insanely easily, and leave it for another, like, 20 seconds, if that, without the lid on, but now on the other side. And you get over medium, where the inside is still gooey, but it's, like, gelatinous. Only like, uh, it's like gelatinous, kind of like the eggs that you get with uh, like ramen a lot of times. Like the, this will still be sort of gelatinous, but this is just insanely lightly cooked, like just above what over, over easy would be. So you don't pop it once and then it just pisses everywhere and gets all over everything and not in your mouth. Instead you get like gelatinous. It's perfect for dropped eggs and toast because it'll just be runny enough, but not really. Perfect for sandwiches because it won't be that runny. It's perfect, absolutely perfect, and delicious with the pepper, the nice little pepper. Pepper makes it look less pretty, but also just makes it cook amazing. Omelets, all that stuff are great too, but I'm just talking like, like if I was gonna make like a nice, a nice like breakfast on a Saturday or Sunday, sure, like let's talk like fancy breakfast, but I'm talking, I wanna get ready, I wanna stream, I wanna be done eating and I want protein and decent fats in my body and be done with it. Like, I want to I wanna be over it and move on as fast as possible. Like, I don't... Breakfast stuff is annoying. Eating is annoying on your day-to-day. -day. I don't like dealing with it. I like to be done with it as fast as possible. So, I'm like, how can I make stuff good, but fast? Um, did you initiate the rant? No, I, I just was thinking about eggs today because I've, uh, I'm now on, like, several, several days in a row of flipping it successfully without breaking the yolk. There was a long, long period of time where my over medium eggs have just been over medium with runny yolk all over the place that got cooked because it pissed down the side of the, the, the uh, pan. But, but over medium is fantastic. Golden brown is pretty much over hard though. Once you get to like that, you're like almost over hard. If, if the yolk, if the yolk isn't still gelatinous in some way, shape or form, then then it's uh then it's not over medium anymore 
The same way that like a medium rare steak isn't medium rare if it's not pink on the inside anymore. 